Hello and welcome back to the new farm. We are actually at a place that deals in used cars at the moment that's behind the garage. Uh, I don't know if you see, saw a short, we put a short out of us test driving a Land Rover V8 uh, yesterday. We've come up, up, up here with our car. Um, we bumped into the farmer who actually owned that, um, that comes from quite a way over the other side and we've actually managed to gain some straw because he's cut two fields that come up behind the row of houses and someone was supposed to take the straw out of it and apparently they're not now anymore so he said we could actually have it um, now we're just in the process of selling the Mitsubishi to this guy uh, that has like some quite nice used cars around Audi there and sells them from home so we're just about to complete the paperwork because we have actually gained nine thousand pounds from selling this and we've actually bought this Land Rover V8 we probably can't afford to run it um, but then again we're not going to be going very far really we're not going to be going on wild trips with it because I'd imagine it's going to drink fuel like no one's business so we're just going to complete the stuff for that then we can take this right so that's it the Mitsubishi is no longer but we are up £9,000 and that, they've just paid that into our bank and we've got the paperwork for this and the keys so we'll go and take this back to the farm Apparently this might have belonged to a young kitty at some point, or s someone that liked tampering with stuff. Hence why it's been done up a bit. But whilst we were out test driving it, we uh, had someone pull out in front of us, so I went to beat um, to tell them they were stupid. And this happened. So it's got a um, what sounds like a Darude sandstorm horn. So we won't be using that too often. So we'll leave this here. We have got something else turned up because I was a bit cheeky to the shop and I had said to them after we had the 5 series I said it would be nice to have a 6 series and see what that's like so earlier today they actually brought one down but this one has a loader and we've actually sold the 595 now and the car and we've bought this springtime cultivator as well so we bought the cultivator but the tractor and loader is just here on demo so we've got to get the baler on now anyway and go and sort this straw out because he said he wants it shifted as soon as possible drop that off there see if we can get to that baler without moving the massive bugs up we'll just do that stand up and we'll get down the road So 
however we've gained quite well that'll get us some free straw that's as high up as that loader will go not quite sure how much you'd pay for straw on the ground but we've definitely saved money there so he said it's just at the end of the row of houses and there's a right turn apparently and he said all the gates are open so it must be this one, that one goes into the shop oh, here we are so we'll get in here and just start bailing just this little field here behind the houses and that big one that over the other side of the hedge there I did say to us that um, we might be lucky and get some contracting jobs as cultivation has come up. It's all bailed up and we move into that next one. So we're just in this other field now. We did end up with nine bales out of that other field. There's a bit just underneath that combine there we can't get. Yeah, so we got nine out of there. So have a guess what we think we're going to end up with. I reckon maybe about 40. lucky enough to get 40 
have a guess what number you think we're going to get and I'll look at the counter at the end and see what we've got. So we finished out in this field now and I've got a bale figure and that is 39 it may have been 40 if I could have got that bit underneath that combine so that was a good guess so let us know what yours was so we'll get back with this and go and get our carting device So we've just popped our baler back in here. I think I'm going to put this straw over in that shed actually. Right at the back in the corner. Otherwise we're going to lose space in here and we've got nothing in there. So we've got our bow carter on. So we're going to pick them up. So that is all our bows carted now. So we've got all 39 back in here in this big long shed. So just left the tractor and the carter there. So that'd be alright for there for now. I'm just gonna jump in the man rope and go home. And first thing tomorrow, we need to get onto the shop about we need to try and find the straw blower. To chop up straw to put into the cows over there and have a chat with them about how they can help us do our drilling so thanks very much for watching this episode and we'll catch you again shortly cheers <laughs>